hi families how are you i hope that everybody had a wonderful uh family day weekend it is february 22nd i can't believe that we are coming to the end of february already i wanted to show off some of the amazing work that uh, your children have done we've got our uh, olympic ring flags our canada flags and if you can notice on the side the chinese flags were started today representing where the olympics took place so we've really been talking about how uh, we share the planet, uh, which is our, our current unit of inquiry from uh, the IP, IB program. Um, so using these flags, students have found them in various places and uh, they've been pointing them out um, as well in our um, medal counts. We've also been talking about France and the United States. So they have quite the uh, list of flags that they are starting to uh, look at. We've also talked about, or I'm going to be talking tomorrow, sorry, about the Korean flag because we're talking about shapes also. Um, and so that's going to be a fun flag because there's circles and a bunch of rectangles. Um, and I used to live there for a year, which was really, really cool. Um, short week. Uh, we are here uh, only four days. Just a really small reminder. Uh, some students have been talking about being cold. Um, if it's possible to send a sweatshirt, um, sometimes students are coming with t-shirts or just a long sleeve. Um, if you can bring a sweatshirt or send a sweatshirt for them, that would be amazing. Um, just another reaching out sort of in terms of dietary restrictions. I'm going to send a picture of the poster. Um, I understand the challenges that this places on some families, just understanding the restrictions. Um, but we have a friend in our room that's beside ours who uh, has some pretty severe allergies and uh, he does daycare in our room and they share a bathroom. So that's kind of the, the reason why we are um, as on that as we are. Um, so I'm going to send that poster out also, just a picture of it, um, just to make sure that I know that I've tried to communicate. I know that Mr. Bozzi and uh, Ms. Rumford probably have as well, but it's just more or less for my own conscience to make conscience to make sure that uh, I'm communicating to the best and fullest of my abilities. Um, other than that, uh, we are building some words. Um, if you want, actually, I can take you for a little adventure in our classroom. Um, as you can see here, uh, students are using different medias. So uh, this is my and me. Uh, it probably looks a little bit backwards for you. Uh, but the students are currently uh, building some fun ways or learning ways how to um, create words. Uh, so we have sent home uh, some... I've sent home lists of words that we have to, they have to know by the end of kindergarten. So we're just constructing them a little bit differently than just always reading and writing. So we're building them and trying to add a fun element to the learning process. So um, the other thing that I will say, and I'm in the process of, actually I sent it the other day, is, excuse me for one second. Uh, the site word bingo, so I have it here. Um, if you are hoping to play this at home and you don't have access to a printer, I can photocopy this and send this home uh, with your son or daughter. That's not a problem. Just communicate with me. All good. Um, some families have asked how to play this game. All you need to do is you have the griffin up, the words are down, and this you have to mix and match the words and you have to find the matches. So we would go with we and my would go with my. Um, the, they would have to find another the, and it's just having basic conversations about the word sounds, the letter sounds, the word itself. Hence, so it's just trying to learn through play, learning through uh, different games it's, uh, and such. So uh, that's kind of the hope uh, to to mix some fun in with this and make the learning between school and home similar, so that they're getting similar experiences, and so that we're just continuously, collaboratively building uh, their knowledge uh, as a, a school community. Um, as partners in their education. Awesome. Thank you so much, everybody. I hope that you have a great rest of your Tuesday night. I am looking forward to uh, going home uh, and seeing my family as well. So take care. Thank you so much.